All right, so welcome back to the shop. Today we're gonna to be working on trying to fix my tripod situation. Um, you may have noticed that some of these videos are kind of, well, not very good, and I'm trying to fix that, and I feel like one of the best ways to do it is to address the situation of my tripod falling over and me not being able to get very good shots. So in order to remedy that, I have uh, the tripod from an old telescope that is now unfortunately not with us. So this part, uh, this this bolts in to the uh, rest of the tripod. There's a, a bit that this sort of squeezes down on. Of course, it's very adjustable. And then this section would have been sort of where the telescope was mounted. Now what I'm planning on doing is using this microphone stand and it's quite long and it locks really nice and sturdy. I'm planning on using that and um, taking just some random junk. This is a weight that uh, sometimes you can find in various different products if you know they're trying to make it heavier. It's just really low quality, just mild steel, but it should do okay for us here. Uh, hopefully I can actually weld to this, <laughs> I haven't tried. Um, and then I'm gonna use a piece of square tubing. So my plan here is to basically just take this part, drill two matching holes so I can bolt this on here turn some threads on the end of this that match this and then stick this in here and weld it up and hopefully that'll provide us a very very sturdy mount and then at the end I already have a piece that I had made for attaching the camera to the end of end of the uh, microphone stand so let's get to it a quick PSA to everybody who happens to have a lathe with a threaded spindle please Put some never sneeze on the threads every now and then. Uh, it's a pretty common issue with these lathes that people will lock the spindle to get the chuck off and the chuck doesn't want to come and then, well, you're sitting there with a hammer and it just goes downhill real fast. And usually the bull gear tends to be the one that gets the short end of the stick and loses some teeth in the fight. Also, you don't need to put the chuck on that tight. That is tight enough right there. So I would say it looks pretty bad, but um, you know, it doesn't need to look very good. The only time you're ever going to see this is now. And this is a heck of a lot better than my old setup as I can stick the camera on the end of this boom. And uh, this, this extends further and it'll just hopefully allow me to get some better shots and especially on the lathe so I don't have to put the camera tripod like behind the lathe or something like that, like on the lathe table. It's a heck of a lot better than what I was dealing with, which is, uh, well, quite frankly, uh, this is about as straight as it gets. So we'll call that good for now.